What is going on guys? Welcome back, Marco here from BlitzKita.com Today I'm going to show you how to play this famous song, it's called Tarantella Napoletana and it's, um, it's a famous motif that uh, I grew up with because I'm from Naples I'm actually not from Naples, Naples uh, town, but I'm from a uh, very small um, village next to Pompeii uh, so we're pretty close to Naples and um, I grew up with this motif it's really really famous and it's really characteristic of uh, the you know tradition okay um, Napolitan tradition so I'm really happy to show you that you can get the full tab absolutely for free uh, just check the description and click the link if you create your account uh, at blitzguitar.com it's totally free guys and you have access to a lot of lessons I think I have probably about 30 plus videos at the moment so you get a lot of free stuff and you just have to create your account it's very very simple just check the description and click the link if you want to have this stuff plus all the free lessons that you get with the account okay so let's have a close up and let me show you how to play the tarantella all right guys we're gonna start with um, this one now what I have is a beautiful motif and it's very catchy okay so I'm gonna start with the first string fret number five twice okay and then I have the fifth open string the third string fret number five and the first open string play that simultaneously thumb index and ring and then the first string one more time okay so I can basically start with that position first string fret five then I get rid of the um, third finger and I play five three and one and then just the first open. Then I will do exactly the same thing. Just um, one time when I pluck the three strings. Okay, so. And you don't really have to go on and off with the fingers like that. You could just hold this one down and just go on and off with the third finger. So. Then I have the first open string twice and I change chords and I go to position one so what is that I have a D minor this is a D minor chord and I have the fourth string open the third string fret number two and the first string fret number one okay I block that simultaneously four three and one and then I have first string twice more okay so and then the melody will keep going like that so third fret and first fret again and we uh, finish the the melody um, with the fifth open string and the first open string okay so whole thing together so far is this one and then I keep going with the melody so what I have so we're gonna play the first string twice more Okay, and we move on to the next chord, which is the D minor chord. That's a nice melody, okay? So I have the fourth string open and the first string fret number one. And the melody goes like that. We only play the bass note at the beginning of the phrase, simultaneously with the first string fret one. Then I have the first string fret one twice more. Then fret three, fret one. And we finish the phrase with the fifth open and the first open. Okay, so the whole thing together. Okay, 
Now we're gonna have them. What is that? We're gonna have the um, um, the first open string twice more. Okay, so. That's the last chord we played, and then we have the first open string twice more, and the fourth open and the first open, and the second string fret number three, twice more. Okay, so chord on the A minor, we have the third string, sorry, the second string fret number three with the fifth open string, then the second string fret number one, one more time, and then the fret number three, okay? So from the D minor, that we're going to use to end the first part which is this one sixth open string and the first open string and then the melody will keep going and we have first string fret number one first open second string fret three second string fret one second open okay so first open simultaneously with the sixth fret number one open second string fret three fret one second open and we finish with the fifth open string and the first string sorry third string fret number two thing you're gonna repeat that twice okay so the first part is repeated twice so the beginning of the second part is exactly the same uh, we're gonna have the third string fret 2 and the second open string and then I have the fifth string open with the second string fret number one second open fret one okay now this is when we have something different so so it starts exactly the same then we have the sixth open string and the third string fret number three so it's three one and then fifth open with the first open, second string fret three, first open. Okay, so then I have the fourth string open with the first string fret number one, first open, third string fret, second string fret two, second string fret number three. Sorry. Fifth open string and the second string fret number one, second open, third string fret two. Alright, let's do it slowly. Sixth open string with the second open string, third string fret number two, and the third string fret number one. And the dog is barking. And we finish with the fifth open string and the third string fret number two. So
make sure that you start maybe just with the melody and remember always to play the bass note to the right place so that as many times as you want it's a song that never ends so thank you very much for watching make sure that you get the tab and create your account at blitzguitar.com see you next time